Hello you guys, welcome back to another video. We are starting this video super early. It is 5.30 a.m. So last night I fell asleep at 8 p.m. And guys, this is the first time in weeks. If you guys watched our last video, I told you about how we had some troubles with Kai's um, sleeping. Today was the first day in weeks that I got more than three hours consecutively of sleep. So I literally feel brand new. I woke up at 4.30 in the morning to feed Aria. She woke up. So I just gave her a bottle and she went back to sleep like super quick. And it hit me. I'm like, wow, I'm like not even tired. Like I'm actually pretty alert. So I'm like, why not take advantage of that and start my day? So I can't talk too loud because Kayvon's room is right next to my office. So I don't want to wake him up. And we're starting it on a great foot. Um, it's so funny because I was just like scrolling on Twitter trying to decide whether I wanted to go back to sleep or and I saw this tweet which I'll put on the screen so I'm like this is kind of like a sign to me to actually like start my day but it's funny because the tweet I saw right after that was this tweet and I feel like Twitter has been doing that a lot they put like two different opinions like right next to each other on the timeline but then I saw this tweet and I was like should I go back to sleep but I'm like no honestly guys like I'm actually pretty well rested and well energized i have not felt like this in such a long time so it's just such a foreign feeling to me now so i feel real good got my ice water ready to go i'm like i can drink more water today i can get a workout in i actually have a lot of work to catch up on i had some stuff that i was gonna do last night but like i said i fell asleep early that i didn't do so i can do it now i need to call the bank and guys the bank the wait time for some reason the customer service on the phone has been insane so i'm like maybe if i call them now um, earlier in the day it'll be less of a wait so i got lots i need to do so let's have this productive day So guys, we decided to come out and get a little breakfast. Thank you. I have been craving coffee since I woke up this morning. And Mel made me coffee before the doctor's appointment, but I forgot to grab it because we were running out the house. But guys, Porto's lattes, gotta mix it. Unmatched, so good. Have you ever seen something so chunky in your life, so tall, babe? He's literally just sitting there with his cheeks just overlapped over his strip. No, she started screaming. So. Here she is. She just wanted some laughter. She's not screaming, don't play me. But she was like, eh, eh, eh. People just, were looking. She was just babbling. People were looking, though. People can mind their business. That's my little girl. She just wanted to see the world, see? Just wanted to see everybody. Looks like you're holding up single. Apron's coming on, so y'all know what that means. I'm about to cook some lunch real quick. Let me tie it. If you guys have seen on TikTok, this is called like the BBL apron when you tie it like this, because it'd be like snatching you. So I'm gonna be cooking a meal from HelloFresh. You guys already know we love HelloFresh in this house. We've been getting HelloFresh for the past few years, and the meals are always so delicious and so easy to make. So you guys get everything you need to create your meals right to your door. And they also send you these handy dandy little instruction cards. So it cannot get any easier. You guys can see it's like pictures, step-by-step -step instructions. And they send you all of their fresh ingredients. So again, it cuts out time from having to go to the grocery store, meal plan, meal prep. That's just doing the most. I don't have the energy for that these days with three kids. Here are the three meals that we got this week. So we have these burgers right here. And we also have this crispy kicking cayenne chicken cutlets. Ooh, that looks so good but this is the one i want to make because i'm in a pasta mood this is the southwest beef cavatappi look at how amazing that looks here are the instructions right here on the back okay hair is clipped up i'm gonna wash my hands real quick and we'll get straight to cooking <laughs> 
So let's get started with this pasta. So as you guys can see, I got everything I need. I'm just filling up my pot with some water to get it boiling while we work on the ingredients. I'm just slicing up the peppers and the scallions. With it being the New Year's, I'm sure a lot of us have some goals that we want to achieve, and I love that HelloFresh makes it easy to achieve those goals. They have so many different meal plans to choose from. I love their calorie smart and carb smart meal options. A feature HelloFresh recently came out with that I've been loving is the ability to swap proteins or upgrade your proteins. So you guys can see this meal came with beef. We can easily switch it out for turkey or whatever you'd like. They have over 35 recipes every single week to choose from. That's honestly my favorite part is just going on there and picking my recipes for the week. I also love how all of the ingredients in your HelloFresh kit comes to you from farm to you in less than seven days. So you know that everything is going to be at its peak freshness. HelloFresh is also an easy way to get you out of your cooking rut. I know someone like me, I can cook the same things over and over again. I've really enjoyed learning new techniques and flavor combinations throughout my years of getting HelloFresh. I have such an amazing code with HelloFresh right now, so if you guys still haven't tried it, this is the time to try it. So you guys can go to HelloFresh.com and use my code Kavari21 for 21 free meals plus free shipping. So make sure you guys check out that link down below. Guys, this pasta, too freaking good. And I made it so quick. It took me like maybe like 30 minutes. It was so, so fast. The meat mixture is delicious. Like I could honestly just eat it like by itself. Cutest little audience right now watching me do this. Hi, cutie. Hi, cutie. Look at my cutie. Look at my cutie. Look at my cutie. Hi, Riri. Hi, Riri. Uh. See, look, I took the camera off of her and now she's smiling ear to ear. I swear, Kai and Arya are so opposite in all aspects. Kai loves the camera. Arya hates the camera. I don't even know. I don't even know. Let me turn off these LED lights because it's pretty distracting. Where's the remote? Okay. Last thing I want to tackle on my productive day to-do list is handling this basket from hell. Now, most people have a chair from hell. I don't have a chair from hell. I just have a basket that I keep just to keep throwing like miscellaneous items in and then it just piles up and then I leave it. And I'm like, today is the day I'm going to put it away. You guys are probably like, girl, you just worked out and you're still in your workout clothes. The thing is, if I shower and put on my jammies, like I'm just going to chill for the rest of the night. So I'd rather just do this real quick and then I can shower and, you know, relax and end my night. So baby girl is going to cheer me on. I turned on the heat when we first came up here, guys, and now it's like a boiler room. Whew, it's like when we don't have the heat on, it's freezing. Then when we have the heat on, it's like a sauna. Like I can't. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put this all away. But guys, we went to this diesel event. So Justice, you guys know Justice and Kayla. Um, he hosted a diesel event and then it was 30% off the whole store. So I got this super cute diesel white tee. It's a great like basic to have in my closet. And then I got this dress. Unfortunately, the purses were not part of the 30% off because they said last time they did that, everybody was just buying purses. So they didn't do it for this shopping event, unfortunately. But I got this dress. Danny actually picked it out for me. She's like, I want to see you try this on. And it actually looked really good on me. So it is like this short halter dress, super duper cute. Oh my God, Arya's like staring into my soul, it's so cute. So showing you guys that dress just reminded me of something I wanted to tell y'all, but I am going to be doing the closet in my beauty room. So right now it's just like your standard like builder grade closet. It's just like one rack. And you guys can see, like you can even see right there, I have all those dresses hung up. So those are pieces that I've already worn. Like that was like my 23rd birthday dress. Like I have all these like statement pieces. And I used to sell them. Like I would sell them on like, I haven't really used Poshmark in a while, but like Depop and stuff like that. But now that I have a daughter, now that I have a baby girl, I 
like it's harder for me to get rid of things. Let me know if you guys have a daughter and the same thing happened to you. But now that I have a daughter, I'm like, I can save this for her. Like I want her to see like the dress I wore to her baby shower and you know, the dresses I wore for my birthday. Like I personally would have loved if my mom kept some of her pieces, but obviously with us like moving countries, like that was really hard for her to do, but I would have loved to have that. So I don't know what to do. Actually, you know what? I think a cube, like one of those like storage cubes and then you vacuum out the air, that might be a good idea. So I might do that. I got this super cute black puffer vest from Zara the other day. Ow! That hurts so bad. But I got this black puffer vest at that like incredible Zara sale that's happening right now. Um, I also got this blazer from Zara. Guys, I've been doing so much shopping. I need someone to take my credit card away because I have been shopping way too much. It's because I'm finally like not pregnant anymore and I'm not planning on getting pregnant. So I'm like, I can actually like enjoy clothes again, if you know what I mean. Um, I don't know if I like this blazer that much. This is probably gonna get returned. It's not my fave. Cause I got another blazer that I like a lot more. So this is probably gonna be returned. Most likely it's gonna be returned. And then from Aritzia, you guys love these jeans. I posted them on my Snapchat, which by the way, I've been using Snapchat a lot more. I put it on my screen right here so you guys can follow. But y'all were loving these pants. So they are, they were on sale for like 70 bucks. These are the Levi's xl flooded pants i got lots of basics i got this super cute shirt it kind of reminds me of the skims shirts i thought this would be cute with those pants and then like some accessories on top hi maria ballerina i love you ballerina i love you can you guys see her if i close the door hold on maybe you guys can see her if i close the door can you <gasps> you can see her hi baby girl i love you I was supposed to be cleaning my closet and I'm giving you guys this impromptu haul. So let's get into organizing this closet. I'm definitely going to get interrupted doing it, but it's better than doing nothing. Because again, this has just been sitting here for way too long. So let's get to it. I did not know this was collared. Absolutely not. What? I did not mean to buy this. I don't know how this ended up in here, but... This is what I thought I was buying, the brown version of this. 